Okay, so the problem is the base of a solid is a circular disk with radius 5. Parallel cross sections perpendicular to the base are squares, and you're looking for the volume of the solid. So, if you draw it, it's going to look kind of like that the circle radius 5, and then this coming out here is a square. And so, since you're looking for the volume, you're going to have the area of the square, so area is side squared um, times the thickness of the slice, which is your change in x. So, that's your volume, and you're going to get the side in terms of x, so you're um, going to need the formula for your circle in terms of x, so you're going to have y is plus or minus the square root of 25 minus x squared. So that's your formula for your circle up in the square. And then we're going to use that the positive is this half right here. So if your side is this entire length, then it's going to be 2 times this arc. So side equals 2 square root 25 minus x squared. So that's your side. And then to find the volume, you're going to take the integral from Uh, you can do negative 5 to 5, but it'll probably be easier to just do 0 to 5 and then double that. So what you're going to have for your integral is 2 times the integral of 2 square root 25 minus x squared squared times dx. So with your integral you have here, this is taking the volume from here to here, and you're going to double that, so you have the entire half. And then you're going to take 2 times the side right here, and square that to get the area of the base. And then times the change in x is the thickness. And then from there you can just plug that into your calculator and you end up with the volume is 2,000 over 3. So, that's that.